Welcome everybody to today's tutorial. Uh, my name is Geordie Elliott from Performance Feeds and today we're going to cover off uh, Mag Plus and Grass Tetany and Grass Tetany control and management in your beef herd. Um, grass Tetany is a is a quite a quite a difficult problem to deal with um, and it can it can have an extreme impact on your herd with with the impact of, of dead cows and loss of production and that through through subclinical cases. Grass tetany is also known as its technical name of hypomagnesia. Uh, is a, is, an, is the extreme deficiency of magnesium in your in your in your beef herd or dairy herd. Uh, mag grass tetany is caused by the de deficiency of magnesium in the stock, or it can be caused as a secondary problem of a high high case of potassium in your in your herd. Grass tetany is specifically caused when cattle are grazing short, lush pastures that is under environmental stress. Ideally, this time of the year when we get our cold, overcast, miserable days, uh, this will be the this will be the biggest impactor on what is happening. So the, the plant is under the stress of cold while it's short and trying to grow in the early autumn and mid-winter, um, right through into, into the later winter in some areas. Every area and every farm reacts differently at different times, and this is where you, you as a producer should keep track of, of what happens and plan, plan ahead with each year coming of what, happened, what has happened in the past. So management in the early stages of your production in your pasture and some of the agronomy work you can have a detrimental effect to your magnesium status in your cows. High uses of potash and, and potassium in, in the grass can block the uptake of magnesium from the cow. This can induce a secondary, a secondary dose of grass tetany in your herd. Um, this can only be relieved with a larger amount of magnesium supplemented to the, to the cows and a large amount of dry matter to keep cows off pasture. Right. Magnesium is a tricky product to, for cows to handle and a tricky ingredient to, to, to work with. Magnesium itself is not stored in the body for very long um, and is hard to keep a high supply in the cow's metabolism. But when this runs low on these bad days and it can only take one to two bad days to cause the deficiency of magnesium, this is where we need to bring some practices in, into process to control how the effect on our cows is going to be. Ideally, we need to keep hay in front of these cows over this period of time. This will help with the recycling of magnesium through the saliva of the cow. This, will, this is the best way to keep magnesium up in the cow when, the, when there is some magnesium missing in the diet, but this will only keep you going on an average day. In a, in a bad case, we need to supplement high amounts of magnesium in a palatable form to keep the cows running and to keep them taking, them, taking this product. Some of the symptoms you may see with, your, with a magnesium deficiency is aggression and un unsteadiness and staggery of cows in extreme cases. And the most extreme cases will be sudden death or, or extremely fast death. Um, without, without emergency assistance of a, cal of a calcium injection or calcium magnesium injection, then we will see rapid death of cows in paddocks. Magnesium supplementation can come in multiple forms for your herd. These can range from blocks and loose licks for some pre-emergence of problems um, and preventative and knowing when it's coming and preventing what the issue is, to min, min jet bags for help when the cows have gone down and keep these cows alive. Um, this is your emergency last case scenario to save your cow. And this is where we help prevent the problem from beginning in the, in the very first place. A major issue with supplementing magnesium and managing your grass tetany at this time is palatability of magnesium supplements. Magnesium is a very unpalatable product in, in itself, so it's getting it in a form that is easily uptake by the cows with consistent over the, over the whole herd uptake of the supplement that is key to keeping your cows alive through this period. Um, some products use excessive amounts of, of sweetener to keep them to keep eating the product, but they're then eating it for the wrong reasons. Or we can use hot, try and hide, mask the taste with waterproofing agents to make them uptake the product. This way, you're not getting any wastage from water from the from from rain or anything like that, and the cows are taking it for the reason of supplementing for a lack of magnesium. For more information about grass tetany and your grass tetany management can be made from Caztech. 
um, or Ray White. And, and this is a difficult product to try and handle at any time of the year. So more help is always needed and get the information that's always available from your local people and your local stores. And thank you very much.